Before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. Hey, how's it going? It's Axel Grave coming back with more reactions with an X, and today I am continuing on that Mob Psycho 100 series. I'm super excited to continue it. As you guys know, I've been liking Ritz through Raygun and Mob, as well as all the other people's characters. I'm not always the best names, I'm sorry, but I know the characters. Uh, and we're trying to finish up season one today, right? So we stopped on episode eight last time, now we're episode nine. We'll see how far we get. Um, and we're trying to get these ready to do three times a week when we do anime like this. So we'll binge through them. I know people like to get through those. They're like, all right, I want to see them. And until we get more suggestions for other anime series you guys might want to watch, that's how we're going to break it down. Um, it's fun to do these and edit them and put them up, so I hope you guys are enjoying it. As always, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. If you did not do it yet and you did like the video, remember to smash that like button, comment, subscribe, etc. And uh, no, I really appreciate it. I like to chat with you and check it out. Um, always support the original content on Crunchyroll. The link's in the description below. Also, near... No, not near it, but in the description below, you can find a link to the Patreon where if you want to see uncut, you know, no changed in opacity videos, I really got to figure out a better way to say that, full opacity, full opacity videos, they'll be there for all patrons for as low as a dollar a month, and that includes backlog stuff, as far as I understand it, you can go back and see it all. Um, we may end up changing stuff later, but now that is what we do. Special thanks to our current patrons, and no more talking for another minute and a half. I know you guys. Don't want to hear me talk for that long. You want to watch this fucking episode, so let's watch this this episode. <laughs> ah, that's right. We're in the um. Uh, I forget the name of the, the psychic organization. You might get special treatment. Uh oh, another enemy. Oh, and he's got like followers or sidekicks or something. I'll make sure that the in the worst possible person. I missed his name. I think we'll go back for it later. Yeah, they'll say his name again. One. Yeah, so one published by... I thought so. Claw. Seventh Division. That's Claw. I don't know what Seventh Division is. Maybe that's the Seventh Division of Claw or of some other organization. Scars. So they're called Scars. Koyama's an idiot. His abilities are the real deal. But if he joins us, he'll probably be... Oh, he's gonna kill him. He just doesn't want more competition. Okay, thanks? Is that what I was trying to say? Ooh, Kageyama. Hey, this is 100%, 150% hair. Anything you need to know, you let me know. Oh, the next attacker should be showing up any second now. <laughs> He's a smart guy. Oh. Did that soda say mob? See, and that was what I was kind of getting the feel of. Was that mob doesn't go hard from the start, and then anyone who can like finish him quick would be a good challenge. Ooh, harsh torture. Oh, nope. Oh, he has Takara with him, though. Oh, he let his guard down. Oh, we don't even get to see it. <laughs> Why is the parents down? Did they did they do the unspeakable things? Hers on her cheek, but more on her jaw, not her jaw. Her. I don't know what that bone is. Here's chicken. Cheek. I'm just having fun finding the scars. Oh, hello. Oh, that's a leader. That's not a scar. It probably is, or she. I like how one of them is a circle and the other's face is a square. 
ナチュラルのガキどもあまり私たち教育係をなめるないよお前ら新入りはまだ構成員と認められてもね I'm feeling he's stronger than they are Maybe not that guy あなた上司の人ですか僕たち超能力なんてありません何かの間違いだから家に返してください超能力を持ってないけど石をと口裏を Oh wow his chin and that's where his scar is too Uh oh. No, the other. Oh, he's a smart guy. Oh, that's right. He's the younger one. Oh, did he get dark for. Ah,、oh, I didn't expect him to get that dark. So, we're gonna assume that all those guys are roughly as strong or stronger than the one guy who fight Mob, which is probably a bad assumption, it's usually not that way. I mean, he's floating the car there. Okay. Oh, he's the voice of freaking Kuhn. That's why he. That's, that's, that's the same guy. I don't know who the voice actor is. It took me a second. I was like, why does he sound so familiar? I like how it's his middle finger that's making the whip. Maybe that's just me. But I like it. I like a little devil tails. Why do you even ask? And he has this across the bridge of his nose, which is interesting. He just. Oh, they do have a red suit. That probably changes his policy on using.、Uh... Technically, means nothing before absolute power. Yeah, probably. I mean, maybe not. It just depends. But he has been shown to be ridiculous, dumb, strong. Yeah, I was gonna say, his, his powers wouldn't work. It was a, it was a trick. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. I, sh I did think that, but didn't state it because I was hoping it did get dark. But it's a kid's one. It's kidsy. No one dies in these kinds of ones. Not like important people. Named characters don't die in these kinds of shows. Just like One Piece. Except for flashbacks. They don't count. To be fair, I don't remember none of their Ray names. Ray. Uh, why? Why do they overhype themselves? Like, I like how those two in the middle with very, like, not impressive powers. <laughs> really, it's like we're badass. Uh. Oh wow, he's got more fire than he used to, at least. I have a feeling that Kagiyama is not at all. <laughs> He's bringing him into his position. Oh, that's right. He, he did it last time. He's activated it. Hey! Hey, he did it on his own. 
を開けさせるまでもなかったんじゃ。めっそうもない。なあ、しげよ。エクボは危ないよ。ええ、リスーパーデイジス。体を乗っ取れば、有利にことが運びそうなのに。超能力者はみんな精神プロテクトがかかって。ええ、でよ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、なんで弱ってるのお前に除霊されかけたときに。もういいや。He's like, why were you eating? You almost killed me! Like, that's dope. I, I really want to see these kids progress. Like I said, these shows are about side character progression. Oh! Dude! It's because we both hit him at once. Holy competent minions? What? What? Competent minions? I, I didn't lose. I mean, Dorado rushed into things. Yeah. Ah. Oh, hey, he's gonna be a fun fight, but is he gonna be a real fight now that Mob is like. Whew, okay, there's her one. I think I did see her one. Don't know where that one. Full body scar. Oh. His on the nose, but it's like the bridge or whatever this is. Yeah, this one, uh, this was somewhat yeah, what I expected. Not in this exact fashion. I was like, one hit, but he's just, you know, pinballing him around the room, which is great. I love it. Oh, to hold back. So that's. He also knows he's strong enough to know that that guy can probably take that. It's like, eh, why is it always the underestimation of the army? I mean, granted, they're kids, so. That was great, though. Uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching. I mean, I really did like that. I thought it was interesting, so now they're just implying that in the last fight, that he was just totally holding back, even when he kind of, like, semi cade into his white form which i didn't think was the case i mean it feels like which made sense because i feel like it really wasn't a big deal like the stuff he did in the fight versus what was that koyama whoever that scar was he just beat the crap out of was like not nearly as impressive as the kind of fighting that he did subcon not really even the fighting but just the feat at the end of his fight first fight versus or his fight versus takeru kind of fight i guess Where he destroys the whole school and lifts it like into the atmosphere. That's a way bigger telekinetic feat than any of that. Boosh! Like, that's cool, but that's like one focus thing. Like, telekinetic powers can be insane depending on the scale. You know, you got people who can put together planets and sh with their brain in certain manga and anime and stuff. And it feels like Mob is probably not quite that level. Maybe that level, but definitely bridging. Shit, I'm not supposed to hit that. Definitely bridging that level of kind of like medium city size, maybe continent to planet. We haven't really seen the full, you know, scope of his power because he doesn't seem to really go serious consciously. He kind of lets off when he's, you know, subconsciously when his emotions break. But otherwise, we haven't really seen that much. And we don't watch previews for the next episode for those who don't know because I want to just see the next episode. I don't want to ruin it for me. Uh, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Special thanks to our Patreons. I hope you enjoyed the July stuff. Uh, this stuff is hopefully coming out still at the end here, July, and the, the August package should be coming soon. Uh, we're trying to stay ahead of the curve on our content because we're going to be coming into some times where it's going to be rough for us to record and make new stuff. So we're just trying to keep things regular and consistent and get ahead so that when times things do happen, we don't fall behind. Uh, as always, if you enjoyed, uh, check out Crunchyroll, check out Mob Psycho. Go down there and check us out on Patreon if you really want to support. Get full passing videos, no cuts, as well as exclusive content. We're trying to figure out what we're going to do exclusively for our patrons right now. I'm thinking maybe one of the like Ruby side things or maybe some like... Maybe we'll do like Ruby with commentary or something. You know, do a real deep, in-depth thing because I know the channel really likes that right now. But any suggestions are welcome because I love watching new stuff I haven't seen. So without any ado, we're going to end this video and say thank you very, very much. 
Thanks everyone for watching another episode of Reactions with an X with me, your host Axel Grave. I appreciate every single view and every single comment on these videos. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit like to show your support and hit subscribe to see more reaction videos. If you like the other content we do on the channel, remember to hit the little bell and press all to see all of our videos. Finally, if you wanted to leave us a comment or a suggestion on other material we to do, or just to rip us to shreds, leave a note in the comments and we'll try to get back to you.